if people feel that they can question authority, that they can check that behaviours are as they should be, the workplace is better, the company is better, the organisation you work for is a much safer place. It's dangerous for boards and businesses to fool themselves into thinking, well, I don't have groupthink here because look at the diversity in my team. But if it's not inclusive and if it doesn't feel psychologically safe, there will be people within that group that will not be making a full contribution. And so that's why I think psychological safety is so important because diversity on its own, I think, will only get you half the way. The reason it's important is that you get the best out of everyone, that you understand actually how people will perform at their best level and how you create an environment where difference is really valued and appreciated and everyone gets a voice. You know, it makes me so cross when I see all the wasted talent that's there uh, in women who don't feel that they either have a place around the table or they don't feel enabled and encouraged to take advantage of opportunities. It's been a great journey, but there have been issues along the way that I've had to deal with. And if I can share the stuff that hasn't gone as well as the stuff that's gone brilliantly, I think that is a great thing that women can, can learn from as well. I think the more you engage in events like the one we're all taking part in tonight, the more that you build a network of like-minded women, but also men, any, any allies, the people who've got your back that can give you that encouragement. It is great to be in a room where you're not a minority, um, and that's happening more and more, which is brilliant. It's a great place to share stories. Um, it's a great place to just feel, you know, you're not alone in thinking these thoughts or having these feelings. And I really hope I can just help somebody with a little technique that might help them along their journey.